It's a dog-eat-dog -dog world out there, or sometimes a mongoose-eat-snake world. Sometimes stuff just gets weird. We've put together a selection of some of the most surprising standoffs between predators and their prey, and things don't always go the way you might expect. So stick around and see just how feisty some of these underdogs can get. From a brutal head-stomping murder to super stylish evasive maneuvers, here are 20 preys who can defend themselves from predators. Number 20. Woodpecker Fights Furiously with Snake A teeny-weeny crimson-crested woodpecker takes on a colossal 10-foot-long snake in an attempt to protect her nest, and it is a tough watch. The snake is relentless, just going again and again at the poor little bird. The woodpecker receives at least four bites from the reptile, but each time it picks itself up again and takes up the defensive position. Snakes habitually go after nests, and they generally aren't fussed if they find eggs or chicks. They'll gorge on either with equal glee. The tenacious little bird is absolutely determined to protect her nest and is pecking at the snake with all of her might. She's prepared to fight to the death to save her children. This is how it is for some parents. Even the bird varieties have these extraordinary instincts when it comes to their babies. Who knows? Maybe even King Cobra is afraid of this snake killer. Before we go on, like this video, smash the subscribe button, and click the notification bell right now, or this centipede will crawl on your face when you're sleeping. Number 19. Mother Elephant Stamps a Crocodile to Death Mothers are, without a doubt, the fiercest and most determined of all creatures, so it really should come as no surprise that this female African elephant fought one of the most deadly of all Earth's animals, the Nile crocodile. This crazy footage shows the crocodile that's been stalking a baby elephant suddenly encountering that baby's mama. And that mama is mad. She immediately takes care of this danger to her child, appearing to dispense with the toothsome reptile with a few well-placed and utterly merciless stomps to the creature's head. Yeah, that'll certainly do it. This angry elephant quite literally stamps this 15-foot crocodile to death in the shallows of the Zambezi River in Zambia. The video would be shot by a tourist on a safari tour who was transfixed by the intense and sudden violent attack by the animal. Well, we often think of elephants as being gentle giants, and for the most part they are. But if you mess with them or make them feel threatened in any way, these enormous animals have some very fierce powers at their disposal. This crocodile never really stood a chance. Number 18. Brave Mother Hen Fights with Eagle to Save Her Chicks and now we have yet another video of a mother protecting her babies. These animals just never seem to learn not to mess with a mama. This time we're thrown into the middle of a perilous fight between a chicken and an eagle. The plucky little hen is doing everything in her power to battle the dangerous bird of prey and protect her chicks from becoming the eagle's snack. It's a pretty brutal encounter. The eagle has all the sharp talons and vicious beak that you would expect. The chicken has her pecking abilities and a whole truckload of fierceness, and she's prepared to throw herself completely into this fight, she will defend her brood whatever it may take. The hen makes herself as big and angry as possible and then repeatedly throws her whole body at the eagle as it advances. For every attack move that's made by the bird of prey, the chicken counters. She stomps all over the eagle, scratches and pecks, and will never give up. Each time the eagle retreats a little, the hen just keeps on pushing, trying to scare off the bird. The video ends while the pair are still locked in battle, so we can only hope that the mother hen won this time around. Number 17. Hippo Grabs Lion By Its Head let sleeping hippos lie. That's the message here, I would reckon. And if you must disturb one, you should keep your distance. A lioness stalking through the Maasai Mara National Reserve in Kenya spotted a hippo laying in the grass, and I guess it thought that a lounging hippo was easy enough prey, or at least not much threat if she went to have a nose around, but boy was she ever wrong. The huge hippopotamus was quickly alerted to the lion's probing and whipped around grabbing its head in its mighty jaws. 
That's not exactly a place to put your head, really. They have gigantic teeth, and a hippo's jaws are so powerful they can literally crush bones or splinter a wooden boat in half. This lioness was lucky enough to be able to get free from the hippo's grip with her head still attached to her body, but I should imagine she learned a pretty big lesson and will probably refrain from poking any more hippos anytime soon. She'll be giving these beasts a wide berth. Number 16. Stray Dog and Lioness Fight whether this little hound is fearless or foolish, well, that's up for debate, I reckon. Picking a fight with a couple of lionesses doesn't seem like the most sensible option available, but this stray dog, while wandering the Gur National Forest, decided to take on this pair of Asiatic lions. It can't end well, surely, you will say, but as it goes, fortune does favor the brave, and in this case, fortune is not getting eaten by a lion. But this scrappy dog stunned the Indian Forestry Service with its brazen antagonism towards the lioness. He barks and bites at the lion, and even though the big cat is much bigger and stronger, it doesn't send the hound running for its life. When folks began to see this crazy footage, a lot of them were quick to point out that this is an example of how stray dogs can spread diseases amongst the wild animal population. Some are particularly nasty and can cause serious problems for big cats in particular. So although it looks like this scrappy dog gets away with being really naughty, perhaps the lion simply knows better. It's probably not even worth the fight. Number 15. Buffalo vs. Lion this video begins with a sad scene. A buffalo is under assault from a lion, and it's beginning to look as though the buffalo might be in a bit of a pickle. But then suddenly, a couple of more buffalo appear on the scene, and the whole power dynamics certainly shifts. One buffalo charges right in and hooks the lion from where it lays, tossing it up into the air like it's nothing at all. It uses those large curly horns to flick the big cat away, and when it tries again, the buffalo just discards the predator as if it were nothing more than an irritating bug. One of the most temperamental and unpredictable of animals, the African buffalo is also gigantic. While these big guys are not predators, they have been hunted, so they know to recognize a threat when they see one or even when they don't. The problem with buffalo is that you simply can't tell what they might do next. With a mighty bulk and some staggeringly dangerous horns, these animals are not to be messed with. According to those who have experienced a buffalo, these extraordinary creatures can remember an individual hunter from one day to the next. So, if they had encountered someone before, then there was a very big chance they would remember and lead the assault on the would-be hunter instead of waiting to be attacked again. The same applies just generally, actually. The buffalo's best defense against a predator is to attack first. They'll charge without any warning if they do feel threatened, and even if you don't intend any harm on them, there's no way to get the message through to their heads. Number 14. Harbor Seal versus Giant Pacific Octopus Wrestling a giant octopus might not seem like a sensible way to find yourself a square meal, but harbor seals are especially partial to these leggy sea creatures, despite the challenge of getting a hold of one. But an octopus isn't exactly going to surrender to the seal's dinner plate. These feisty creatures know how to put up a fight, and the seal's going to have its work cut out for it to take it down. An incredible battle between these two mortal enemies would be captured on film in British Columbia. The seal grabbed a hold of the octopus, and then they dipped under the water. Again, the tables have been turned by the time that the pair resurface, the octopus having completely wrapped itself around the harbor seal's head. The epic battle continues on with the two locked in mortal combat for at least 10 minutes. It could have gone either way, but ultimately the seal's determined assault wins out and he bags a big lunch. So even being the most well-armed guy in the fight wasn't enough to help the octopus in the end. Number 13. Ninja Rats Evade Rattlesnake Attacks the Sidewinder Snake is a venomous pit viper, also known as the Horned Rattlesnake. They're a kind of unpleasant species to work with, to be fair, and there are few animals that would actually want to encounter one of these reptiles, least of all in the dark. So, when small kangaroo rats encounter these unpleasant and distinctly deadly vipers, you would think that the little rodents were goners, right? Well, actually no, not always. The diminutive kangaroo rat has a plethora of skills to avoid the death grip of the sidewinder, and 
they are impressive. Over the course of several nights, researchers in the desert watch the interactions between these two species, and it turns out that not only are the kangaroo rats efficient in avoidance techniques, they're lucky little so-and-sos as well. The kangaroo rat has long and springy back legs, hence the term kangaroo in their name, and it turns out that they use their unique legs in combat with snakes. The ninja stylings of the kangaroo rat involve a remarkable ability to jump out of the way of an oncoming attack. Despite the speed of the snake, the rat is oftentimes even faster, and they also seem to be able to land a solid kick to the face of an attacking snake while simultaneously avoiding a bite. Those are some mad skills indeed. Number 12. Gentoo Penguin and Giant Petrel a group of baby penguins waddling alone in the sea seems like easy prey for a big bad giant petrel, but these fluffy flightless birds have a few tricks up their ridiculously cute little sleeves. The giant petrel is a massive bird with a wingspan of up to six feet and a huge pointy bill, a dangerous predator indeed, especially amongst a vulnerable pack of little emperor penguins on their first outing without their grown-ups. First, the petrel manages to attack, pulling a penguin from the group, but the penguin is surprised surprisingly quick and wriggles free from the bird's grasp. Then the power of the pack kicks in, and the emperor penguin chicks know that there's safety in numbers, so they form a circle protecting each other and standing tall against the petrel. A stalemate then exists, and the penguins stand their ground as the giant petrel settles beside the circle, waiting for an opportunity. Just then, an ally appears on the landscape, a small but feisty Adelaide penguin. This fierce little one, even on its own, is enough to see off the petrel and help the emperor penguin chicks carry on their journey. Number 11. Slender Mongoose Kills Black Mamba it takes a plucky little creature to square up to any predator, let alone a really nasty and deadly snake like the black mamba. The venom of the black mamba is so very effective that it has an almost perfect 100% kill rate in humans. That's chilling. So just what this little mongoose is up to seems the tiniest bit mad. It's likely that there's a nest nearby that the little mammal's protecting from the deadly snake, despite just how bonkers the idea may seem. The mongoose has quite the reputation for taking on some of the deadliest snakes on Earth and, well, kicking their asses. They're particularly adept at killing a snake, even one as aggressive and venomous as a black mamba, and it's incredible to watch. Well, it turns out that not only are these little furry mammals kind of good at killing snakes, they're also well equipped with a secret weapon. They're immune to snake venom. So that helps out in the bravery department, I should imagine. Number 10. Pregnant Rhino Fights Off Hungry Lions Ah, oh, you know how it goes. You've been having a bath at the local watering hole when a group of flipping lions turn up and begin to threaten to eat you. They've got no respect for your privacy and just hang around waiting for you to get out of the water. They don't even offer a towel or anything. The cheek of it all. Bored by their idle threats, you eventually resign yourself to being the end of your relaxing soak. These lions then begin trying to have a go at you. I mean, seriously, have they not seen your epic frame? Three against one does look like the lions have probably got this one in the bag. They do have a go, but the rhino has tough skin, up to a couple of inches thick even. She's also massive and powerful with a really pointy horn, and when the mighty rhino is out of the water and on equal footing with the lions, she simply outsmarts them. In fact, she chases them in a couple of little circles, leaving the bewildered big cats in the dust. It's awesome and incredible that this creature barely breaks a sweat. Number 9. Mama Bear Picks a Fight with a Tiger to Save Her Cub In Tadoba National Park in India, the summer temperatures can reach such extreme highs that it can seriously impact the availability of water sources for animals that live there. This gives dangerous animals an easy opportunity to wait and stalk prey without any effort, as the animals are forced to share the watering holes with many other creatures. It's a risky thing to stay hydrated when there are dangers at every turn. This tiger is taking full advantage of the easy pickings down at the watering hole and has its beady little eyes on a bear cub 
cub that's arrived with its mother. However, the sloth bear is not about to give up any kind of battle for her baby with every ounce of her might, so when the tiger pounces, the mother bear is ready to take it on. They're locked in the fight for a full 15 minutes, tearing great chunks out of each other, snarling and clawing. Now, you may expect the bear to not withstand an extreme pressure that's being dealt to it by the tiger, however she does, a mother with a baby to protect can summon incredible strength and will lay down her life to defend her child. It seems the tiger forgot about this though. They eventually part, both with unpleasant looking injuries, however the cub remains safe. And so the tiger just goes on to find something less labor intensive to eat. It is too hot for all of that wrestling after all. Number 8. Hippos vs Crocodile well, that's just rude. A herd of more than 50 hippos would be hanging out in a pool in Tanzania when a crocodile figures that since they're in its way, he's just going to walk over the hippos' backs. In the natural order of things, if the crocodile decided to try and eat the hippo, the two strongest jawed creatures would occasionally face off in an altercation. But for one teeny croc to attempt to bust a path straight through a huge group of hippos, well, it's kind of a risky business that could prove to be a fatal mistake. The hippopotamus has a mighty bite that puts it amongst the most powerful jawed creatures on the planet, and that also includes the crocodile. <laughs> but it is really the sheer scale of these hippos that makes the crocodile's efforts seem especially flimsy. Each of these massive mammals weighs a couple of tons, which when alongside the crocodile makes that usually fearsome creature into an insignificance. The hippos look pretty peeved at being used as some sort of stepping stones by a little upstart of a reptile, and they're not afraid to show their disgust at this presumptuous behavior. The disgruntled hippos trap the crocodile in their mouths and simply toss it back into the water. It's hard to tell, but you can almost see them roll their eyes at each other as well. Number 7. Zalika the Hyena Fights an Ostrich this new brood of ostrich chicks attracted the unwanted attention of some of the Serengeti's less desirable creatures, that being the hyena. Things don't look good for those bird babies. Hyenas are a formidable pack of animals and have extraordinary skills when it comes to teamwork. So a weak little heap of chicks with only a daddy ostrich to protect them from a whole group of predators? Well, never underestimate a father who's protecting his babies, least of all an ostrich. They're kind of jerks. As the hyenas begin their hooting and hollering, calling instructions and information to each other from across the plane, they then begin circling. This is usually a bad sign for whatever they've got in their sights. Hyenas are clever and chillingly efficient hunters and killers and will use their numbers to wear out their prey, gradually increasing pressure and circling until the animal is exhausted and has very little energy to fight off the final attack. However, an ostrich is a formidable opponent itself, and one with babies to protect has a whole other level of determination to defeat these cackling predators. Ostriches use their incredibly powerful legs as their main defensive weapons. They'll usually run away since they can outrun most other animals, but this is not an option for a parent who's protecting their young, so they have other options. They can kick with such force as to seriously injure a predator or even kill them if they land a kick in the right or even wrong place. They have sharp large nails on their toes which can be employed to slash and stab as required, and this daddy bird makes surprisingly light work of dispensing with the irritation of the hyenas. It keeps the chicks safe, draws the threat away from the nest using a whole host of aggressive and fierce skills to defeat the predators and then send them packing. Number 6. Prickly Porcupine vs Leopard and what's next, I hear you cry. Well, don't cry because it's nearly the end. It's an encounter between a magnificent big cat and a sharp prickly rodent. This should be a good one then. How does a rodent that weighs about 40 pounds fend off or even kill a mighty big cat that weighs a few hundred pounds? Seems like there's no way that it could, really. On paper, the leopard has it all, the strength, the speed, and the size. However, the rodent in question is a porcupine, and these prickly little creatures have a unique and sometimes deadly weapon at their disposal. You'd think that leopards would have stopped trying to eat porcupines by now. It rarely ever ends well for the big cat.
Porcupines, as you probably know, are covered in really sharp quills. These prickly sticks can poke into a persistent leopard, and it sounds uncomfortable, right? Well, these sharp pokers can actually cause fatal injuries. If one pierces the leopard's heart or a major artery, that big cat will literally bleed to death. And the porcupine? Well, it would probably just trot away, minus a quill or two. That instant death spear isn't the only way that an encounter with a porcupine can end up in big trouble for a leopard. Scientists have discovered that animals which have porcupine quills stuck in them can suffer from long-term problems. They may find it hard to hunt, depending on where the quills are lodged, and this can make them more likely to attack humans or livestock, both of which usually spell death for a leopard. This could end up being death by a thousand pokes, or even just the one well-placed spike. Number 5. Water Dickup versus Lizard The small and pointy water dickup takes great care to choose the best place to make its nest. It settles in for a while with the river on one side and a colossal crocodile on the other. Yes, this brave little bird chooses to bed down beside the crocodile on purpose. There are very few animals that will come close enough to a big croc in order to pick a fight with a teeny weeny inconsequential bird. A crocodile's presence? Well, that's kind of like having a 24-7 guard dog. There is one species that doesn't seem to get upset about a croc proximity issue. That is the monitor lizard. These reptiles are determined nest ransackers and are a genuine threat to the safety of the bird's eggs, or indeed even their young. So it's of no wonder that this pair of water dickups are using every trick in the book to see off the pesky reptile. They make themselves super big by stretching their wings out and being ultra confident and defensive. You know you wouldn't want one of these birds mad at you. Number 4. Epic Seal vs. Shark Battle Although seals themselves can be considered in the category of stone-cold killers, I mean seriously, if you ever watch these animals picking off penguins, it's like a party trick, then you know what I mean. But you would probably expect them to come off the worse in a fight against the great white shark. Every once in a while, though, there comes along a seal with a couple of defensive moves and a whole sack full of luck. The Atlantic White Shark Conservancy is an organization that tags and monitors great white sharks. out doing just that off the coast of Cape Cod when they've captured a hairy moment between a monster-sized shark and a seal. Usually this goes one way and it's not all that great for the smaller creature. Seals are a favorite dinner for the shark on the account of their lovely blubbery flesh making a substantial meal for the predator. But this little seal must have had his wits about him that morning as he performed a perfect evasive maneuver followed by a bit of a whack on the shark's schnoz which allowed him to make his hasty retreat. The people on board the boat observing the behavior said that although this particular seal got away, another one was not so fortunate, and there was still a bloodbath before the day was through. This shark was not put off snacking on seals even for one little moment. Number 3. Lion vs. Crocodile well, who knew that lions like to swim? This is all news to me. Here, we have a video of a couple of lions taking a dip in order to cross a river in Botswana. Apart from the fact that it's surprising to see two lions willingly climb into the river, what happens next is the most shocking thing about the footage. As they paddle across the river, the person filming the moment spots movement in the water nearby, and it becomes apparent that a crocodile has also clocked the lions taking a dip in the river. Now, it's a matter of waiting to see if the lions can make it to dry land before the crocodile can swim in and intercept them. It's a super tense thing and the result is shockingly surprising. The crocodile gets there first and the lions, while out of their own territory, look like they may be in a whole heap of trouble. One lion thinks better of the situation and beats a hasty retreat back across the river to where he began, but the other one's not so fortunate. It looks as though it may have fallen foul of the toothsome predator's favorite hunting technique of dragging their prey beneath the water until it drowns. It's brutal, but yet it's efficient. And since we never see that lion surface again, it seems as though the croc may have won this round. Number 2. Gazelle vs. Lion 
The local watering hole is a very risky place to hang out. This is a spot where many animals seem to suddenly and unceremoniously meet their maker. Lots of predators know this is a great place to lurk and wait for an unsuspecting snack to wander into their crosshairs. All animals need to take a drink at some point, you know. So it's a guaranteed buffet for the bigger, badder creatures. This gazelle is standing daintily at the water's edge having a drink when all of a sudden a massive lion runs into the frame at full speed. It's quite shocking to see just how fast this all occurs when the lion's in full flight like this, and it's no wonder that they're the kings of the jungle. Except that this time, the result is not what you might expect. The gazelle, although clearly surprised by the lion's appearance, seems to have a special skill at the ready. This animal simply does a rapid turn, and instead of running in the direction that the lion is heading, the gazelle turns on a dime and hot foots it in the opposite direction altogether. The lion can't turn a complete 180 while such at high speeds, and by the time the predator realizes what's happened, the gazelle has escaped. Whew. Number 1. Rat Shows Cat Who's Boss being chased by a rat is basically one of my recurring nightmares, so this is a video that's actually going to haunt me for the rest of my entire life. What a fun one! Anyways, what we have here is a video of a cat that's mooching about in the street of a town in Luxembourg when it seems to spot something moving and goes in to take a closer look. Well, upon further inspection, the cat discovers that it is, in fact, a rat. Now, usually you'd expect this would go one way. You know, the cat chases the rodent in the traditional time and Jerry style, the kind of scenario that we can all comprehend. But this time around, the cat is suddenly startled to discover that the rat has actually turned the tables and is now in pursuit of the cat. It's not ideal, and almost certainly quite an embarrassment for a feline amongst their peers. Not to mention the general horror of being aggressively chased by a rat. Oh, I really wish I could unsee this one. And there you have it, the underdog does sometimes get the upper hand after all. That makes it all feel like the balance is restored in the universe. So what did you think of all these small, surprising animals facing off with much more deadly opponents? And have you ever seen a predator get outwitted by a much smaller animal? As always, let me know all about it in the comments section down below. Be sure to check out all the other cool stuff that's showing up on the screen, and I'll see you next time.